What's going on guys? Eric Bikema from The Same Lifestyle and today I'm coming to you with a video I told you I would in a previous video for this week and that is on a question I get so many times in my DMs and sorry if I sound a little stuffed up I don't know what the hell this, these snowstorms brought into Colorado but whatever it is it's really messing with me might just be a cold or it might be well <laughs> I don't know just comment it down below but anyway one question I get all the time in my DMs is a bunch of guys sending me pictures of their body and they're what I would call skinny fat, which is you have skinny arms so you have some fat around your midsection, or the typical hipster or dad bod. And they're saying, hey man, should I cut or should I bulk first? And let me explain a little bit about what you're talking about. Now for most people when you send me your physique, I will tell you the bulk. And here's the reason why. Okay, unless you were like right here and you are morbidly obese and it's dangerously overweight, then you should start cutting because that's just dangerous for your body to be at. But if you are over here, like most people are, and you are what would be called skinny fat, then you definitely need to start bulking. And why is that? That is because your muscles have not been fed enough to actually Row. Because I can guess if your body looks like this, then you've probably been sitting at the couch for way too long, eating junk food or eating very little junk food and just playing video games. And let me tell you, that is not how you're going to get your muscles to grow. What you need to start doing, and a lot of people fall into the same trap, is they want to lose fat. So how do they do that? They drastically cut their calories and they do hours of cardio, which is probably one of the worst things you can do. Now let me explain to you why most people who DM me are like this and they should start bulking is this main reason. So I'm gonna make the math easier on me. Let's say you're uh, 150 pounds. That's what the typical average male weighs. Or let's say, uh, let's say you're at 20% body fat, which is overweight that would make about 32 pounds of your weight body fat but what you can do to remedy this is let's say you want to get rid of that fat so you look good well what happens if you are this and you cut and you lose about let's say 20 pounds of fat you now look emaciated you look frail you look like the wind is going to blow you apart like you are not that strong you look sickly that is what's going to happen. And that is why I tell people they need to bulk because what looks better? Being thin and a little bit lean at 135, 140 pounds or being lean at 185 pounds. That way you look strong and you look good. So let me tell you, if you are in the skinny fat dilemma, the one thing you need to start doing is you need to start eating better food and more of it and you need to start doing a good weight training program because that way because it still blows people's mind how some people who end up eating more calories make more gains and actually lose more fat than someone who drastically cuts their calories and does hours of cardio. Why is that? Because they have fed their muscle. Usually if you don't have muscle, you are not eating enough to feed your gains. And yes, you do need to eat more calories to build muscle because your body can't build this muscle without the help. And this is why I tell everyone that DMs me this, that they need to start eating more food, cleaner food, and they need to start lifting weights. Because once you start building that muscle up, it's going to be much easier for you to burn fat. And that's because your metabolism is going up and the process of just eating clean and training properly, you're going to boost your own metabolism. So your metabolism is going up and that way when you do decide to lose that fat and get shredded for the summer and lean, you can do it a lot easier than most people can because you have muscle that needs to be powered by fat. And I said for every additional ounce or pound of muscle you have, burns an additional 40 to 50 calories an hour because your body needs to maintain that. And plus, would you rather have people, when you lose all that fat, come up to you and ask you if you're sickly or like if you're eating enough, or would you rather have people walk up to you and say, dang bro, how did you get so 
big. So once you begin eating properly and in a caloric surplus, you will then be giving your body the nutrients it needs to build muscle. So last thing I need to hear about, last thing I need to talk about is about old school bulking, which was eating everything in sight and gaining literally 40 pounds of fat in the off season. You don't need to do that anymore. What you need to do is eat clean, which involves eating good carbs, proteins, and fats, and eating in a caloric surplus. That way you are giving your body the nutrients it needs to grow and repair itself. Because when you are working out in the gym, and you're breaking down the muscle, which breaking news for many of you, you don't build muscle in the gym, you break down the muscle so you can build it later. When you do that, you give the body the nutrients it needs to repair your body, only then are you going to build muscle. So there is my answer to all of your questions. If you want to build muscle or just look leaner when you are skinny fat, then you need to start bulking. And by bulking, I mean eating clean and lifting heavy and hard and training properly. And you want to do all three of those and to get the body that you want, then head over to my Instagram, what are you waiting for? And DM me the word muscle. Yes, hop into my DMs and DM me the word muscle. And you can get the body of your dreams, get the body that you want and do it quicker than I did because you're going to avoid all the mistakes that I made. You see, I was dumb so you can be smart. And of course, if you are not like that and you are trying to lose weight and you're definitely obese, I will help you lose that fat. You just need to DM me the same word. Actually, no, DM me fat loss. And you'll learn in the future video why I hate the term weight loss so much. But anyways, that is it for the video today. If you liked it, give me that thumbs up, smash that like button. Also, anything you want me to cover in a future video, comment it down below in the comments below. And also, if you really want to improve yourself overall and become that alpha guy, subscribe to my channel for more content coming soon. And I'll see each of you badasses later.